Good morning. Hi. I didn't think you'd show up. I stand up the future mother of my child. What do you take me for? A human being. Please, I can't handle compliments before noon. I'm just trying to apologize. All right, apology accepted. What did you do? I was a jerk. I was a jerk. I didn't mean to hurt your feelings. Oh, you didn't. My feelings are pretty resilient. I thought it would work. I, I, I just rose up in the hotel room. I thought it would work. I, I did. I guess what I'm trying to say is that when two people make... do what we're contemplating, it has some effect on them. I mean, it just doesn't mean nothing. I think maybe our mistake was trying to spell everything out legally as though it were a roofing contract. <laughs> I mean, my mistake. Would you let me speak for myself? I'm sorry. And stop apologizing? Julia, when, when somebody wants something as badly as you want this, your emotions can't help but get in the way, at least a little. I've never wanted anything so desperately as I want to know. Ever since I decided to do it, I find myself thinking about holding her. Or him. Or him. And, and rocking up to sleep at night. I mean, all these new feelings and images, they, they come at me now. Well, I had a few of those feelings myself. Well, just a few. I'll get to my end of the bargain. I'll be more than happy to watch from the bar. Those aren't the only feelings. I mean, since you've agreed to help me with my ambition, it's natural that I, I've grown to have a certain uh, fondness for you. There, I said that. Well, I'll try not to let it go to my head. Thank you for being so sensitive. <laughs> I am really astounded with you. <laughs> but I'm glad that I get a chance to see this side. Well, I want this thing as much as you do, Julia. My shot at immortality. Of course, we wouldn't want the little guy to grow up too much like me, would you? Just as well, I won't be around to pass along my evil way. I know it won't be easy for you to step aside. No, you think not. Just wave a diaper at me. See how fast I run. Besides, that's our deal. Now, don't look too discouraged. We'll figure out a way to create him or her, and satisfy both the contract and our needs. Personally, I'm looking forward to the challenge. Hey, I got my rights, man. I know this is just a good time, but I need to ask you a favor. What's up? Danny, this is trouble. I think it's not bad. Think what is that? Well, I, I see all the signs that anyone should recognize them. They mean. Look, I, I know that it's really it's kind of tricky for you being on the fourth and all the possible ones. Mom and I, we can't even get through to him, and Papa won't even recognize us at all. Well, you know how Daddy always Yeah, well, bring him in, and I'll see what I can do. I'm sorry right now. i got a meeting to get ready for and 30 phone calls. Are you all right? I'm fine. Just bring him in. I'll do what I can, okay? Like the two gray waiting for you to punch in. Hey, I don't punch your time clock. What are you, the director of personnel around here? Hey, wow, aren't we icy this morning? What do you want, bro? Just a little friendly chat. I, I want some advice, I'll ask you. Get off my desk. Hey, what's anything about advice? Huh? <laughs> I was just wondering if you maybe withdrew your request for the leave. Is that a big problem if I take a few days off? Hey, you know, I got it coming. I put in a lot of overtime around here. Oh, Polly, what's going on? Oh, boy, the water's a little rough down here. The pearl was just leaking. Now, he's just that for him. Yeah, well, I could. I haven't noticed. Well, he can talk to me about it if he had a problem. 
What's going on? Nothing. I got, you know, I got an office full of people with nothing to do telling me what I should be doing, that's all. What a bragging, man. I got my own problems. Pro, uh, you know, have you talked to Alice today? I don't know why should I. Something's not right, man. It disappeared. Disappeared? Since when? Well, I was called me last night. She never showed up. Serious? She would never miss her first holiday dinner in that house. Well, that's all. But as a minute ago, she still hasn't called. Nothing. Sort of thing. She went to local hospitals. I did everything. I did. I did a complete rundown. She, she just no way to look at it. Doesn't sound very good to me. I mean, she's still a little shaky out there in the big bad world, right? Right. Uh huh. But you got no idea? Yeah. Maybe one place. One place. Okay. I'll take it. No, 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 no. I better let me check in on her. Okay. Why? Well, because if she's where I think she is, she's gonna be okay, but she probably just wants to be on her own for a while. It won't take me long to figure that out, though, okay? All right, All right. Back to me, Oh, okay? I will. Don't worry about it. Hey, you. Hang in there. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Now, listen, man. I didn't mean to buy you about the meeting. Hey, the hell with the meeting, Paul. Are you okay? Yeah, you know, I just, uh... You got a, a full case, bro, don't you? You ought to tell you to that way. Right? Well, then why don't you get on it? People keep saying to me that I should see him, I should talk to him. Maybe they know something I don't. Mm -hmm. Well, go ahead. Maybe it's the worst. And accept you for what you are. All the things you said are insecurity. False. I'm part of the package. You don't have to apologize for that. Please, I did some things that were wrong. If he I can't did. accept you the way you are, you're better off without him. I don't know what I'm going to do in my life without him. You're going to wake up one day. Today talking, you know, tomorrow's like a way of being good to people, like, of the things worse than young, rich. You know, I've had this pet talk before. Well, then you know how it ends. Yeah, I go on with that wonderful, rich, beautiful, exciting life. <laughs> exactly. But maybe, just maybe, but I'll get a few surprises. Yesterday. Yeah, she came by to visit. She does that. Yeah, I know. That's why I'm asking. Did she seem upset, scared, or uh, whatever? No, I don't think so. I don't think you should worry about her. Uh, Connie, please. I mean, you're the last person that saw her before. 
before she disappeared. You gotta come up with something better than I don't think you should worry about her, sir. Well, well I'm surprised that she didn't get to tell anyone before she left. Wait a minute, what do you say? Did, did you say something to her? No. Nothing. I think that she went up to Big Sur to see if she could find Brian. No, no, no. I, I thought about that already. She knows that Brian isn't up there. I mean, we scoured the countryside trying, trying to track this guy down. Well, it's difficult to track someone down when they are keeping track of you, too. You see, that's what I meant, girl, when I was trying to tell you that it's easier to track down a stranger than to find someone. Oh, 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 oh. What are you trying to tell me? What? Well, Pearl Alice was angry. And you're going to be angry, too. I didn't come back to Santa Barbara after I saw you. I stayed up there, and I found it. I found Brian, bro. Hey, 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 hey. Don't go yet. I gotta go. No. I got one from you. I got you. You know, if you really love me, you were struggling. And I would. He's upset, doesn't want to make it work, obviously. He has his reasons. You're making excuses. No, I'm not. I understand what kind of man he is. That's a pity. You know, you keep making this comparison to me. But you didn't tell her to love you. That's what she couldn't accept. He told you he didn't love you as your stepmother. Well, I always love each other. Well, doesn't want you. Please. Look, I know it's over, but I can't look at our relationship like what we had in the past was it was meaningless and worthless. I have to believe in what we had, even if it's gone. How are you catching it? Oh, that's so cool. I'm just trying to show you that if you have the same cast of characters, there's only one possible outcome. What's going to happen? I'm out. How long have you two been going? How long? How long have you actually been together during this? How many days have you been happy? Things got in the way, I mean... Yeah. I guess it's that. You know, <laughs> the testament of the world is that there's more misery than love than happiness. Open any book. Listen to anyone. I want some idiot that thinks he's unloved. He <laughs> thinks he isn't loved enough. I mean, why do we keep buying that? Why? Because we think that somewhere, somewhere in the past, one man and one woman loved each other perfectly. Well, listen. Well, really to take that one woman in the Maybe I'm no different. Have you there, Mom? Beach? And what's when? Backseat of my car. You have a two-seater. A trunk. Mason. I'm sorry. All right, if you could choose the ideal place to conceive this child, where would it be? Isn't this what you and I have been going back and forth about? Oh, no, here? we've been getting bogged down in specifics. Use your imagination. It can be anywhere you want. All right, some place peaceful. Mm -hmm. Away from all of these people and the peace. Mm -hmm. I know the perfect place. Yeah? We just have to trust you. But before we go any further, I have uh, I have one little condition. What? Oh, it's, it's more like a favor, actually. Eventually, I would like for the child to know who its father is. Mason, you said the Now, eventually, I, I said, when the child is a full-fledged, full-grown adult, not, not before that. That way, if we establish a relationship, it will be more like a friendship rather than a father and child. Really the fact that my child will never know the Capwell curse is a blessing beyond measure. I have some time to think about it. Yeah, you're going to have 20 years. I'll make it 18. And conviction. Well, we got a long trip ahead of us. Want to know where? You like surprises. I like surprises. Right. Hold that thought. How did I find out about it? Found a note written by Brian in my purse, and she forced me to tell you. And still, you didn't come to me. 
I'm going to go talk to him. No, listen, Earl, let me come with you, okay? I can help you if you just let me. Brian, trust me. I don't. All right, well, you don't even know what he's saying. I do. I can show you exactly what happened. I'll find the camera myself. Don't worry about it. Oh, you have it yet. We won't go together. All right, you won't. What? If you're leading me on a wild goose chase I'm here... I'm not! I made the wrong decision. I am sorry. I, I'll make it up. Somebody finally talked some sense into you. Sure. No. It's over. Let it go. I know what you're up to eat, that she does. You're like a bird of prey. You've seen a vulnerable target below, you're going to drop out of the sky on it. Yeah, you are so high and mighty, you never let her be yourself. You don't know anything about what we had. You stay away, not me. You stay away. Look, I'm fine. Sandy, those drugs are going to take over pretty soon. 
You're not going to have any control over your own life. <laughs> and your life is so perfect, no, no, huh? No, no, I have been to hell because of those drugs that Tina got me hooked on. Look, I can... I can face the humiliation. I can live without food. Those drugs are lost in my time. Cece was playing God. That's what no, 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 yes. no. Cece was right. Because I couldn't take care of Brandon anymore. I was an unfit mother. So I lost my What have I got to lose? Huh? A wonderful career. A great life, huh? Look, you're making a big deal out of nothing. But at least talk to Chris with your friends. But will you just get off my back, all right? You and Cruz sold out years ago. I'll plug it to a secret cruise when I look up. Sorry, I didn't know. I was, I was a friend. No, no. I remember the point of the I was a friend of anyone. Call you. I'm saving you the trouble of sending me a squad car. Keep the men to my arrest, right? That's what I thought he was saying. What? Okay. No, 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 I don't trust you. Well, trust me, I'm telling you what he yeah, said. You've got to be saving this up for something. Wait, you, you, you disappointed? You want to drag it on another five no, years? No, of course not. All right, then accept what he said. Why are you angry with me? I'm not. i got a million things to do. I'm trying to get them done. Well, do you trust him on this? I think that he's as sincere as he's said that for what it's worth. Well, I'm never going to accept that, please. Maybe you should think of the things you've seen. Some of the truth that the kids are going to die if you are not directly responsible. I don't know. Are you treating me like this? Or is it? Go. Don't blame me for even leaving. I tried to tell her that you weren't responsible for being unfaithful, but she wouldn't listen to you. I don't want to talk about it. Okay. Talk about it later. No. We don't think that. But the last time you came back, somebody died. This time, I lost you. I think you should leave this time and stay gone for good.
Yeah, I read about Rawlings. You testified against him. Oh, so scared. But it was easy. It was very easy when I thought about it. Could have stopped. Well, how could you? I mean, the guy had all the power. Well, the best I could do was send first of all. I let him out of the window. I worried about you. I was all right. I just went back to being the way I was before. I talked to them, listened to them. But I, I still had the songs and the poems that you wrote me. And I sang them to myself and I said them to myself. I knew that I was sick because someone had loved me. I had loved them. Oh, things would be different, you know, I would have been with you. It's just something happened, and I had to uh, get a sight for one. Did I Yeah, with Michael, with my parents. His name is Pearl now. If I had known he was your brother when I had met him, I wouldn't have had anything to do with him. I never told him all the things you told me about him. And, well, Brian, either you've made a mistake or she's different. He helped me like you did. I didn't make a mistake. What? You finally did it. Oh. All that matters is that I found it. Off that limb before it pokes through the window. Yeah. Men are idiots. Why? Or I wouldn't be here with you if you'd taken. See it in summer. Mm -mm. No. It's nice to remember it. That's where it is, right? Yeah. I am. Thanks. I should thank you. <laughs> Awfully well mannered, huh? Let's have dinner on the way back down. No. I mean, not dinner, I think it's good. Okay. Sit 
Sense had been crying on your shoulder again, huh? Something's never changed. Dude, I'm not down in your arse. I care about you in this room, including your sister and myself. Right now, I'm not sure why. Danny, I broke through the bus. What drugs? Just because you can't handle some hey, 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 you shut hey, up, Amy. I'll talk any way I please, Dad. You got rights. Are you going to tell me about your rights? Now you got a right to talk, say what you want, the right to do what you want, to kill yourself if you want. Is that it? What do you use? Look, if this is an interrogation, I'll be back when I get my I voice. said, what are you using, man? Andy, we are trying to help you. You haven't seen anybody OG. It happens every night in this town, in the emergency room. So I take your hand, we go down there and look at somebody together. Would you like that? When I turn up dead, then you can tell me. I told you so. Oh, I okay? see. I'm talking through my head, Daddy. I'm just a cop, right? I go by the rules. I got nothing to say to you. I am telling you, because I care about you, you should quit. I have seen the consequences of doing dope. I think kids younger than you who don't know who they are. I had to scrape a, a, a 12 year old dude off the sidewalk a couple months ago because he walked out of a six floor window, man. He didn't know where he was. If it had been the third floor, he'd have ended up in a wheelchair. Instead, he ended up in a box. I can handle it. Everybody thinks they can handle it until it's too late. So give me that. All right, look. If you want me to, everybody else does. Can you read it? Yeah. No, 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 no. I don't want any... I don't want to do that. I want Mama to know. Uh, uh, Daddy, do you think you're fully Mama or anyone else? Man, you are fooling yourself. You think you can hide from your Mama or your Daddy or your little sister. I mean, you've got... you got to ask a man and admit that you screwed up. Look, just get off my case, all right? Daddy, come on. Let's go. I'll take the phone. Now, you, you wait outside, please. Wait, okay? Hey, he's gonna be... Yeah, I know that, but he's my brother. Look, I'm sorry. I... Bob, I, I, I care about him, really. I'm not sure. Okay, 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 then. You're not going to stop by talking to me. Burden. Look, I know that you and Eve are going to make it. <laughs> I know you a lot better than you think. You think that everyone should pay for what has happened between you and Eve, what I did once before. So don't you bring me into this this time around, okay? Bother him, okay? Thank you for not pressing charges. <sighs> Don't stop them. I love you. you want one of these? No. These are, I concocted them myself. I call them the Victoria Lane one shot bitter, one shot sweet. It used to be sure enough to try. Can't you understand? I never wanted to have. <sighs> yes, I understand. I understand. I understand. I understand. I'm smart, you know? Very bright. I was president of the debate team. Ask anybody here, but I... Please, don't throw up any more smokes. Don't want to lie. You murdered my sister. If I put you away now... Take the field. Get to the side. It'll never be over. Darling, that's what I'm counting on. I hope. She's a number. How my sister spoke. Nobody's ever hating me so much. Yeah.
one was one smiling. A gentleman never tell. Oh. But, you know, there have been many moments in my life where I felt like I really made a difference. Constance Mary. Most decidedly, like being born again. I hope. I hope she's forgiven. Yeah, I know. At least you and Cruz have a fighting chance. Yeah. Mm -hmm. If Dad heard you giving up, he'd drum you out yeah. of the family. Well, he can't force someone to love him. Cruz never needed much of a push in the direction. I think too much has happened. So tell him you're sorry. My mind, just stay out of it. Just leave it alone, and my heart says, "Don't worry." Yeah, schizophrenia often goes hand in hand with love. I know. I, I, I don't want to hurt him anymore, but I miss him. You forgive a burst of sentimentality, Eden. I do want you to be happy. Is that just our formula for it? <laughs> no, just follow your heart. That's all I can tell you. I want That's about a surefire, I guess. Good in the papers. You see, it just wouldn't do for Ambassador Bradford's son to be missing and the family do nothing. It's not like that. He loves you. He went to that hospital to find out what happened to you. Yeah, I'm sure he had his reasons, and they all have something to do with prestige or some other noble cause. Don't talk about him like that. If it weren't for Pearl, I'd still be locked away in that place. You wanted to come back for me. Well, he did. That's the one thing I'll always be grateful for. Him for. No, it won't do any good, Alice. He's not worthy of your loyalty. I think you're just afraid because you were wrong about it. Look, Michael has always had a way of charming the ladies. He's done a great job with you. Stop it! I am not a fool, Brian. Charm does not work with me. Dr. Rawlings is charming. Pearl has been the only friend I've had since she left. He so much like you. And he loves you. No, he doesn't know how to love. Alice, don't get caught up in with him, all right? Because he's going to destroy you the same way he destroyed me. Why? What has he done that is so terrible? Alice. Look, why are we talking about him anyway? So many other things I want to tell you about. It's Michael. Do you know you're up here? Don't look at me like that. I didn't tell anyone. Oh, the thing is, there's that girl. It's Courtney. She's with him. Where are you going? Sorry. Fine, come with me again. I 
I think it might be better if you didn't come around here. Right. I'm sorry. Bye. Bye. All right. The scenery around here is getting better. Yeah, we're too late up, gorgeous, and we can't keep you here forever. Just sit down. I'm really getting sick of this place. What do you think I'm slamming, Jim? Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Hey, man. Yo, I'll have to take that kind of... You want to arrange something else when you say you want to talk for a week, okay? Ooh, let him go. Hey, no problem. Let him go. Fine. Stop working. Shut up, man. This was the trick for you don't know. Know. Uh, what I said, buddy! I'll handle it. I'll handle him. I'm gonna... I'll handle it, okay? Okay? Take him down the hallway, alright? I'll call you when I need him. Oh, you're gonna be hearing from me again, big guy. Get him the hell out of here. He's going, he's going, man. What has gotten into you? He should have been processed hours ago, Paul. You know what? I don't know what's been eating, but you'd be better off at home. Because Look. you're not doing yourself or anybody else any good around hey, here. Hey, hey, you do your job, I'll do mine. Fine. Yeah.